Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to get Minecraft Marketplace add-ons from the Bedrock Marketplace in your own worlds. This only works on PC to my knowledge, or I guess anything that has Files Explorer. I don't usually make tutorials on this channel, but since so many people have been asking how I get my Marketplace add-ons in my own world, here's the tutorial. And I try to make it as easy to follow along as I can. Okay, so first of all, you have to pick the Marketplace add-on that you want to obviously get in your own world. For this tutorial, I'll be picking Wildlife Jungle. And now, here's the thing. You have to have bought it. You have to have spent money on the mod or DLC or whatever you want to call it. Unless it's free, of course. But if you're just getting it from Realms Plus, I don't think this works. So just keep that in mind. But anyways, you obviously have to download this before you can start anything with your files. So download the content. This shouldn't take too long. I have a very slow PC, though, so it takes a little bit. I'm getting a new PC though here soon, so stay tuned for content with that new PC. But anyways, this should be ready right about now. So when the download is complete, it'll say create this world. Shouldn't say anything else, obviously. So now that we actually have the DLC, I guess we'll call it. Now we have to start working on how to import it to our own world. And this is where it could get a little hard with the files. Okay, so now that we have downloaded the world, we actually have to leave Minecraft, and I mean completely leave it. You have to exit out of it and everything. Okay guys, sorry about that. I actually just had to re-download a screen recorder because for some reason my Xbox game bar um, for the PC, I know that's weird. But anyways, my PC recording device won't let me record without being in a game. So yeah, I just downloaded a new one to record so I can show you guys this part. But anyways, enough confusion. This part can get a little tricky, so just pay attention with me and follow along. First things first, you're going to click Windows, hold that, and R. Now this will open this little run thing. And there's actually already a little input I have here that I've copied and pasted from another video that I watched. And I will leave this probably both in the comments and the description of this video. So... Let me repeat that. In the description slash comments of this video, this link will be here. And when you click the Windows key and R, and this pops up, that's what you got to put in, okay? And then you're going to click OK. Now, this is going to open whatever this mess is. So, I'm just going to expand this really quick. Just a little bit. There we go. Okay. So, you're going to see a lot of stuff here. Only click what I click. It'll make this so easy. Just, just pay attention, okay? So what you're going to do is up here, you're actually going to click local state. So click that, not the arrow, just click local state, the word. This will take you here where games should be highlighted. And you're going to click premium catch, cash, whatever you want to say. You're going to double click that, open it up. Then you're going to go to world templates, double click, and you should have every single... DLC slash mod marketplace add-on thing you have in the game and you're gonna have to go through each of these to figure out which one you actually have or which one's the one you want so let's start at the first one you're gonna double click it you're gonna click level name and it will say the DLC so this one's ocean expansion Okay, it's just gonna be the last one, isn't it? Let's just keep going. Security expansion. This one is Wildlife Jungle. Okay. So once you found the one that you're doing, you're gonna stay here, so stay where you click level name. You're just gonna stay there, and first things first, you're gonna click behavior packs. So double click that. And now that we're here, you should see one thing. This is BP0. You're going to click it once. And then click Control c to copy it. Once you're done with that, you're going to click the outside of your screen. Okay, so once you've clicked this once, you've clicked Control c You're going to click the outside of, like, your Windows area. Your game bar or whatever. Not game bar. You're just going to click the outside. And you're going to click Control v That's going to copy everything over... And put it there. After that, you're going to click this arrow. And you're going to click resource packs. You're going to click that once. 
Control C, click the outside, Control V. And that'll get resource pack out there as well. And you have to wait for it to complete. It's taking a little while here. That's alright. Oh, and by the way, your thing might not like this too much. At least mine doesn't. I use whatever this is. It might sometimes make alerts saying that you've deleted stuff. And that's basically just saying you've taken these and put them back in here, which is what we're about to do. So just keep in mind of that. Okay. So you're going to click this arrow. Once they're both here, you're going to click the arrow. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Click it to before you click to local state. So like the original area. And you'll see all of these. Go to the behavior packs first of all. And I have a lot done already. Uh, you're going to take the BP0. And you're just going to drag it in here. And then once you've done that you can rename it. So I like renaming it so I know which one's which of course. So wildlife jungle is the one I named. Uh, the one I have. So you're going to do that. Then you're going to click the arrow. Go to resource packs and drag this resource one, the RP0, in here. Might take a second. There we go. Then you're going to rename this one, of course. Yeah, see, there's the OneDrive thing. Remove file from your device. It, it gets a little testy, but that's okay. So rename Wildlife Jungle. There we go. Space. Done. Click out of files. And that should be done. I'll see you guys over in Minecraft. Okay, so I have completely reloaded Minecraft. I completely went out of it and then went back in. You don't have to sign out or anything. Just make sure you close it completely and then reopen it. So the loading screen goes again. So now this should work. If we go to create new, create a new world, just an entirely new world. Obviously, there's this basic area. You're going to scroll a bit, go to resource packs. And click owned. And it should show up. Yes, here's Wildlife Jungle. Activate. Then you're going to go to Behavior Packs. And activate this as well. Now, I have noticed a problem with some of the ones I get. So let's go back to Resource Packs. Let's go to the ones I have. If you try to upload something like Animals Pack. This didn't fully work for me in the files. It's just missing dependencies. If it says this... Then, to my knowledge, which is what happened to me, a bunch of things can be corrupted, not corrupted, like, messed up. They can just be, the animals won't look right, none of the things from the mod will look right, they'll be back to their original models and stuff, it, it just, it's messy. So if this happens, I don't really know what to do, because I haven't really tried fixing this yet, but I guess just try to delete everything you moved over, and then retry the process. But anyways... We have those resource and behavior packs in here. Let's see if it worked. Oh, wait, before I do that, let me just creative, easy, advanced, flat world, multiplayer, off, cheat, on, holy stay, keep inventory, mob spawning, mob griefing, off, weather cycle. Okay, here we go. Okay, so I'm in the Minecraft world, which we've added the things we added, of course. So wildlife jungle. This looks all normal. All normal. All normal. Ah. Extra boats. Different boats. Okay. Uh, in my case, I wanted to upload or make a mod that has animals. So I can test if it worked. Ah. By seeing all of these extra creatures. And just to make sure it works, I would just take a bunch of random ones. So, the termite. Great hornbill. Crocodile. Okay, these all look good, so it looks like it worked, and now you have mods in your own world. I really hope this helps somebody. I know it really helped me when I figured out how to do it. Ooh, orangutan. So yeah, I, I really hope this helps you guys. If you have any questions at all, let me know down in the comments. And also, P.S. about my audio. If it was lagging at all during the video, I will have fixed it or added... Um, I may have added words, like, on the screen to help you realize what I was trying to say. But anyways, with that, I hope this helped. Any questions at all, and I'll be happy to answer in the comments. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.